Hello everyone, welcome to our world class school, Featherston High School. Hello, I'm Fatima Jazarfa, currently the head girl of sixth form. When I started this school, um, the first ever competition that I took part in was a poetry competition and um, I actually won that one and one of my poems got published. That was the first year um, of my high school life and that was a huge confidence booster. Ever since then, the school always constantly prompted me to do a number of various things. One of them were um, being part of the um, girls netball team, who in year um, 10 we won the Borough League. I was also a um, winner of a Jack Petchy, and that was a great, great achievement. I got to win some money from the, for the school. As the head girl, I was also able to organise a charity event and we got to make around 40 shoe boxes for children in need and raised extra money to donate to the charity. We won the British Heart Foundation competition, e-poster competition with Imperial and the British Heart Foundation. Um, and that was a great achievement for this year because um, we got to win the school £3,000 this time. Um, and it was an incredible experience in terms of research, teamwork, because we were up against um, really prestigious schools, private schools and grammar schools. And I believe um, there were 50 schools that applied and only 10 were shortlisted. And out of the 10, I believe only two of them were state school, one of them being us. Um, and us winning is an incredible achievement in that sense. All these extracurriculars um, add a lot to my UCAS application and in the future any job I apply to um, but right now I'm trying to get into medicine so I'm making my UCAS application. The thing about medicine is that everyone that's going to apply is going to have those A's and A stars so I need these um, extracurriculars to set me out from the others. What it does is prepare me for my interviews which is a must for all medical school so when I go to an interview and they ask me what else do you bring to the table other than your academia, I have all the long list of things that the school had prompted me to do and the school had ad advised me to do and gave me the opportunity to do so. Hi, my name is Ben Watson. Um, I just started year 12 here at Featherston. During lockdown, I think the online lessons were very effective, very helpful. Um, the teachers used a lot of great resources like online whiteboards to explain things like concepts that we would have, we would have done in person at school. The head of careers at our school um, throughout lockdown kept supporting us and putting um, very useful information about things like apprenticeships or online virtual work experience, um, things like we could put them on things like our university applications. Even through lockdown that, that was really helpful. The schools also supported me in a whole load of other great ways which have really built my confidence and even given me skills for uh, later in life. I took part in a speaking competition, Jack Petchy speech competition, and the school really helped me with that. And several teachers helped me write my speech and put it together. Um, I also entered a cooking competition, which the school really supported me in as, with that as well. They helped me practice, they helped me get better. I, I also did a trampolining competition. The school um, helped me in that as well. They helped me practice, get better. They, I was able to use the resources they have in order to achieve fourth in the school's national trampolining competition. Hi, my name is Dorbury Cole Baines and I was part of the Year 12 Young Enterprise team at Featherstone High School. Our product was a portable paper soap in order to address the COVID situation. Um, the skills we developed were teamwork, leadership and being able to confidently articulate yourself. And this was shown when my team members went to the market and um, they, ha they held a stall and they were able to sell their products. Um, it was really 
exciting to work together with a group of like-minded individuals but collectively we were very focused on what our goal was and that was to increase our sales revenue. I'm really proud to say that my team and I won the Innovation Award for a London area and it was amazing to see that our vision had come to life and what this means for my future is that I can proudly say that I'm an innovative person because that has been evident in receiving the award and I think that Young Enterprise is an amazing opportunity to develop, to develop skills and this will help me in the future because I can use it for applying to university, I can use it in interview scenarios saying that my team had won an amazing award. Hi, I'm Emma Holland and I'm a student at Feverson High School. I do a lot of clubs here because there are so many opportunities and I really like taking advantage of those. I'm a librarian in the student library at school and it's so fun to help out. And it's just, there's this uh, reading room and it's so nice, it looks so nice because it's got white walls but then um, everything is just so colourful, it's really nice to be there, it's really peaceful as well. Sometimes with the year students, they're not really that into reading and because there are so many books, I can help them get into it and it's so nice to see them just reading and actually enjoying the book. So I do piano at school and sometimes the lessons can be really expensive, they're outside school, but school actually provides them for free. It's good that they do it for free because not everyone can afford it. Hi, my name is Aisha Kanisada and I'm part of Bethesda High School's um, Inspire program which is partnered with St John's College. Um, this is an enrichment activity that really helps us when we want to apply to Russell Universities and Oxbridge. And St John's um, programme has really helped us um, because we get to widen our horizons and our cultural capital and I would know topics that I wouldn't have known otherwise without it. Hi, my name is Ekaterina Zedam and during my time in Bethesda I was lucky enough to experience a few international trips. And the first trip we went to was to a Christmas market in Lille in France. Another trip we went on was a trip to Iceland and during that trip I made so many unforgettable memories and experienced so many things that I don't think I would experience as of any other time. We visited the Blue Lagoon, we visited many different waterfalls and got to walk behind waterfalls and it was just so much fun to be able to do it with my friends. During my time at Featherstone with the music department we had many different opportunities given to us. We performed many concerts at different schools around the area and we even got to perform to Prince Charles at a church nearby. Hi, my name is Esteha Almi. I'm currently first year medical student at King's College London. Um, I, during my time at Featherstone High School, I was given so much support, including the ability to get work experience at St. Mary's Hospital. And that really sparked my interest to pursue medicine as a career. Not only that, I was part of a program called FHS Scholars, in which I was given so much interview practice in which I became more confident and I was really ready for my, when my interviews actually came. Not only that, I had a lot of teachers who were very knowledgeable in the medical field and that they kept, they were able to look over my personal statement and really just strengthen it. So I was really confident once I sent my application off. During my time at Featherston High School, since I've been there since year seven, I became more confident as I had a multitude of activities and extracurriculars in which I could be involved in, including being netball, playing netball and being the captain for that. I also did the Duke of Edinburgh Award in which I became more confident and independent as we had to navigate around the countryside. Also, um, during sixth form, I was able to be, I became um, head girl. And I feel like all these experiences really made me more confident and really exposed me to a different um, set of personalities in which I had to work with within a group. So I was really able to adapt my communication and really get my point across and get stuff done and be really organised. My name is Arthur and I'm currently an international student studying in Ohio, USA at Denison University. I'm studying at one of the top private liberal arts colleges in the USA where I'm taking four classes this semester. After hours and hours spent on my application, I received a full scholarship of approximately $300,000 to study at this university for four years. Staff at Featherstone were very helpful and at times spent day and night writing recommendations for me to get into this uni. I'm very grateful to all the staff at Featherstone that put in all the hard work for me to receive such an amazing opportunity. And without the encouragement and motivation, there was absolutely no way I could be where I am right now. Being a Featherstone student my whole life, 
I created way too many amazing memories, like performing in concerts and musicals and being in the charity committee. And I will never forget those. I thank each and every one of those teachers that helped me to become the person I am today.